Welcome to Winners Wellness Center. This is Dr. Winners, and I want to discuss with you today the gastrointestinal profile test from Metametrics Lab and the reasons we might do that. Earlier this year, I had somebody cry in my office, and the reason they cried was because it was the first time in 10 years that they didn't have any abdominal pain. They had all kinds of medical testing, all the scopes, all the tests, nothing showed. What we did with them was this test, the gastrointestinal profile test from Metametrics Lab. And what makes this test so special is it's a stool test that evaluates the health of the gut, of our, st of our stomach, our colon, and so forth. It looks for hidden infections and it looks for markers of how the digestion is doing. And what makes this test so special is that it uses DNA analysis. Now most of the stool tests on the market use culture methods and the problem with the culture methods is that some things don't grow, grow in culture and some things grow really well. So once you collect the sample at home and send it to the lab, certain things in that sample may grow really well and some things may not grow much at all. So when the lab goes to analyze it, they've got a whole different situation than, than what was actually there in the sample when you collected it. And so this test uses DNA analysis, the most sophisticated method to find infections and in organisms in our gut. And with that information, we can get a roadmap together to help you get healthier. So the test is simply collected at home with one single sample and it's placed in a solution that essentially freezes the material just like it is then and when it gets to the lab, the lab can use the DNA analysis with that. So the test checks for anaerobic bacteria in our gut, bacteria that don't use oxygen and again, only a DNA analysis can check for those kinds of, of bacteria. So it maps out the levels of all of those. Then it tests for pathogenic bacteria like H. pylori. H. pylori is a bacteria that can cause ulcers, Clostridium and others. Then it checks for yeast infections, for parasites, and parasites are much more common than you may think, and most of the people that we've done this test on have had some kind of parasite, one or another. And those can significantly interfere with our health. And we think about finding these infections in our gut is so important because 70% of our immune system is in our gut. So if our gut's not healthy, our immune system's not healthy. And if our gut's not healthy, our brain is not healthy. Most of the neurotransmitters made in the body are actually made in, in the gut as well. And so there's a large connection between gut health and brain health. The test also looks at markers such as short chain fatty acids, which are markers of digestive ability of our body, inflammation markers, it checks for sensitivity to gliadin, which is a protein in wheat, and so we know, know if the person needs to go on a, a gluten free diet or not. It checks uh, pH, other digestion markers, and then absorption markers, such as if we're absorbing our fat properly. It's a very sophisticated test. Uh, there's four pages to this test. It gives us great information, and from that, we can create a roadmap to help get you healthier. Just with our assistant, Megan, we found out through doing this testing some of the reasons that she was going into an autoimmune condition and which almost made her blind. And it was important to know that her immune system was off, but it was more important to know what was sending her immune system off, and that's the information that we got from this gastrointestinal profile. I've had this gastrointestinal profile test myself, and I was kind of shocked, frankly, at some of the things I found. So this is a fantastic test to help us give you a roadmap to get healthier through your gut. And if you have a healthier gut, you're going to have a healthier immune system, and you're going to have a healthier brain, and you can have a better quality of life. And those are some of the reasons that you should consider. If we've recommended this test for you, you should consider having it done. And we've only recommended it for you if your history has shown indications for that, and the functional assessment questionnaire that we use has shown indications for that. 
The questionnaire will prioritize systems in your body that aren't working as well as they should and we can target those areas and one of those areas is the gastrointestinal system and we highly recommend we've got great uh, experience and feedback from this gastrointestinal test from Metametrics Lab. Thank you for today.